Hey guys, it's me, Red Wolfie. This is a little update, just uh, telling you on something I'm working. I know I probably look really horrible. I don't feel 100%, so I probably look like I've had... Well, to put it right, I probably look like I've had this shit kicked out of me. Anyway, I created a new character today. Not for me, for a friend, uh, Rover on here, which I cannot remember her name, if you bear with me a second, I shall tell you. Anyway, her favourite Pokemon is uh, Rapidash and Ponyta. So, using that, I created a brand new Pokemon, and an evolution of Rapidash. Um, with the armor much taller, well, just much bigger in general, a lot of armor, um, a lot more like fire and flames and ferocity, and it's a very ferocious Pokemon. And basically, well, I will show you a picture, but like, I don't have a picture on me because I keep drawing them and then giving them to her which I really shouldn't because it's like well I know what it looks like but it's like then I can't show you guys so. um okay so this is yeah this is Rover and it's River Roisian River Rusian this is her page that right there that's who you're looking for, this person here. Okay, that is who you're looking for. You may pause the video and go and find her. Ha ha ha. Um, yeah, so I'm doing one for her, basically. And, well, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, as a bonus, I'm actually working on a plush version of this Pokemon. I haven't even told you his name. His name is Kielbasa. K-E-I-L-B-A-S-A. -E Kielbasa. And I'm working on a plush. Well, I will be. I haven't finished sketching out, like, the saddle, or the back armor, and every, all my sketches do look crappy because they don't have head underneath them, things like that. So, yeah, it's just some of, like, the concepts it's like, also I don't know how you can see, how well you can see, but like, yeah, this gap is for the plush, so like the forelock will come over here, it's not as close as that, so it would be better, but then the ears and the horn, because really you can see the eyes, and this doesn't come all the way over down the nose, because the nose comes out to about here maybe, and then these poke out from the bottom jaw, and they connect up, so it's a pretty detailed, but it has no pattern on it, so you, if you think that's detailed, well, like these, um, uh, knee pads, like shin guards, knee shin guards, that's like very creepy, um, and they've got lots of very fine detail in the flats, but not on the knee, and then they've got leather straps, which will probably just be brand material, and they're only on the front legs, and then this goes, this is like the breastplate thing. This bit would be so that the front legs of the plush can go down and not be like stuck. So that'll be there. Obviously, you've got another leather strap, and there will be one like here that kind of goes up to the back, which is where, because it finishes on this one, there's a strap that goes down here, which connects these two together and this but obviously I've not finished it but it has a little bit there that goes around the tail but I might leave that out I'm not sure um, so yeah that's like all the concept just for the armour not for the actual plush itself so uh, that'll be a uh, that'll be a fun thing to like try and do Some people are so weird. Just on like in general on 
YouTube. It's like okay, fair enough. Anywho, yes, I'm working on Kielbasa, and I have a secret, but I, I think I can tell you, but I don't know because she might watch it. But I'm going to tell you anyway. For Kielbasa, once I finish the plush, which I'm actually going to use for my project in my like sewing home ec class, so I will probably get a really good grade for making a plush with all these detail and stuff on it. So, I've got that. And, if I can get enough money and enough material and enough stuff together, I will be attempting to make a kielbasa quad suit for Rover. But I'm um, obviously if I practice with a little sewing and things like that, I'm gonna get like little scrap bits of material to practice like shaving, airbrushing and all that stuff first. Like I will practice bits first instead of just going straight into it and then it looking really crappy. Um and then for the last sales and I'll have to resort to making her a glaceon quad suit. But um I have quite a lot creating wise so that's uh, that's really it for now it's just um, showing you guys what I'll be working on and I'll try and keep you updated like obviously I can't really take videos in school to show you and this will be made in school I don't think I can bring it back so I'll I'll take loads of pictures and edit them into videos and stuff so you can see what the progress is doing in that so um yeah, I think that's it for now, so I shall see you all later. Um, ciao!